On a year like this where I actually did the stuff in advance, it doesn't take that long. Every year I say I'm going to start early, write a little bit at a time, and it'll be pretty effortless, and which is, I actually did it this year. Usually I would be holed up in my hotel room panicking around now because I've still got a few introductions left to write, but I'm not sure exactly how long it took because it was done in nice little pieces like it was supposed to be done the previous four years. But, but like I said, it's nerve-wracking right now. It is great. Lots, lots of weirdos walking around. I'm disappointed. I thought there were going to be shirtless cover models and lots of chocolate being handed out. But aside from that, it's great. Uh, same part that's my favorite all the time, just meeting new friends, hooking up with people I see maybe once every year or two. It's generally about the people. I love the panels. I love the dealer's room. I love all the programming that goes with it. But mostly it's just hanging out in the lobby and talking to people. My first one was 1995, the World Horror Convention in Atlanta, and that's where I met my wife, but neither of us remember meeting each other, so that probably doesn't count. Really, it was just kind of the same as my previous answer, just meeting people for the first time. This was pre-Facebook, so I got to meet people who I knew online, but not from pictures. So it was a lot of, hey, you're some weird internet handle type thing, so it was a lot different than it is now. Yes, my newest book is called Dead Clown Barbecue, which is a collection of 28 short stories and one novella, all of them really sick and twisted. Horror Writers Association is like every other writers association where you get out of it what you put into it, so if you just join and don't do anything, it's not going to do anything for you, but if you look into it, there are tons of resources available, and if you utilize them, it's well, well worth the money.